Page is set up to help with funeral expenses to help Gypsy. The sheriff is warning people not to give to any of those accounts right now because he says he's not sure where that money is going. Well, neighbors, of course, are trying to piece this all together. Some of them have been scammed for years by this family. KSPR Sheena Elsie shows you some of what court documents revealed and what neighbors are saying now. Investigators say a plan for murder and a scam to get money was all going on inside this house here on Volunteer Way. And as the details of it unfold, neighbors say they're still in shock that they fell for it for so many years. Shelby Squazhinov thought the young woman that lived down the street was just like her. 19, disabled, and living with a disabled family. She's the closest person that I know of. But according to investigators, Gypsy Blanchard, the girl in all those nice pictures, was nothing like her. Not 19, or even disabled. I can't believe it. It's shocking. And that was just about everyone's reaction who lives on Volunteer Way. Shocked about it. After they heard about what was in these court documents. In these documents, Gypsy and her boyfriend were behind her own mother's murder. Court documents show her boyfriend admitted to stabbing her mother, Dee Dee, to death on the bed, all while Gypsy was there. Documents show Gypsy posted expletives on Facebook bragging about what they'd done, and her boyfriend mailed the murder weapon to his home in Wisconsin, where they were both found and arrested. But friends and neighbors still don't want to believe that girl in all those nice pictures was a part of a murder and a scam. It hurts. I still want to be her friend. But investigators say there's still more unanswered questions like where the family was really from and what would drive Gypsy to want to plan the murder of her own mother. They say they're expecting those details to come out in court. In Springfield, Sheena LZKSPR News.